Hello everyone, this is Trainboy54 speaking, and today I'm going to have a quick look at the Trekmaster, or now motorized, train pack of four engines. And they are Thomas, now completely in gold, Percy, James, and Gordon. I had just got this train pack from the train show, as if you all know, I got it along with other Trackmaster Thomas and Friends stuff. It had such a high price, but luckily I was able to purchase it. I did have a lot of fun exploring the train show though. So let's unbox this train pack and have a look at the engines up close. It's a bit easy to get them out of the box and a bit hard to get the engines out of the plastic packaging, but I managed to get them out at last. The box artwork is amazing. It looks like the green fields of Shen Valley. Now that we got the metallic engines on the pool table, let's have a look at these engines one by one. First up, the gold metallic Thomas. Thomas looks so good in gold, from boiler to wheels. It looks exactly like the birthday celebration Thomas, only it doesn't have the birthday hat and it's not covered in confetti. I still have a custom birthday celebration Thomas with a painted running board. Now I have three gold Thomases. The truck that's carrying the gold inside, it looks like a narrow gauge truck, but it's now black. I thought to myself, seriously? Thomas should have a standard gauge truck to carry the gold inside, not a narrow gauge truck. Oh, what the heck? Let him take it! Next is Percy. Well, I know I did an unboxing and checkout video of the 75th anniversary celebration Percy and Mia, so this chrome metallic Percy is now the second Percy that I have. Surprising, isn't it? Just a comparison, here are the two Percys side by side. The 75th Anniversary Percy and the Chrome Metallic Percy from the Thomas, Percy, James, and Gordon train pack. It's sort of easy for me to tear the two Chrome Metallic Percys apart because of the faces and the shades of green between the two. And Percy's mail car too. So, Metalki Orange. Up next is James. Now, he is completely metallic red. They must have had red metallic paint for everything on him. I would have gotten the 75th anniversary celebration version of James, but I thought, oh, I don't want to get two metallic Jameses at once. Just the one metallic James is enough. Maybe some other time, I'll get the 75th Anniversary Celebration James. And finally, Gordon is the last engine to check out. I thought if I get the 75th Anniversary Celebration Thomas, he would be the coolest chrome metallic blue Trackmaster Revolution motorized engine ever. But seeing how they made Gordon so awesome in the chrome metallic blue, I think it could wait until I might somehow get the 75th Anniversary Celebration Thomas and compete it with the Chrome Metallic Gordon. Overall, I think the Chrome Metallic Gordon, James, Percy, and Gold Thomas are the most amazing motorized engines. Now, the only thing left to do is we must give these Chrome Metallic engines a test run and see how well they can go. Each of four of the metallic chrome engines require two AAA batteries. Now let's give these chrome metallic engines a run around the pool table.
Well, that was a good test run. So what do I think about the Thomas, Percy, James, and Gordon train pack? Well, just because it's only four chrome metallic engines for this train pack, I'm going to rate this train pack four stars out of five. As a must-keep, at least. Now, with the 75th Anniversary Celebration Nia and Trackmaster Merlin the Invisible, together with the four chrome metallic engines, we now have the main six metallic engines of Train Boy 54's Railway. Pretty cool, right? <laughs> well, thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed this unboxing and checkout video. This is Train Boy 54 saying, stay tuned for more Train Boy 54 videos of 2022.